हेलो फ्रेंड्स दिस इज द सोल्यूशन वीडियो फॉर क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी सिक्स चैप्टर फाइव एस सी वर्मा द प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट से इज ए मंकी ऑफ मास फिफ्टीन के जी इज क्लाइंबिंग ऑन ए रोप विद वन एंड फिक्स टू द सीलिंग इफ इट विशेज टू गो अप विद एन एक्सेलरेशन ऑफ वन मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वेयर हाउ मच फोर्स शुड इट अप्लाई टू द रोप इफ द रोप इज फाइव मीटर लॉन्ग एंड द मंकी स्टार्ट फ्रॉम रेस्ट हाउ मच टाइम विल इट टेक टू रीच द सीलिंग so this problem is very simple let's say this is the ceiling and this is the rope where this black dot is a monkey and he is trying to climb up on the rope okay so obviously when it tries to climb up on the rope it will apply a tension in the string and obviously the gravity will try to pull this monkey downward with the force of mg where m is the mass of the monkey okay so first of all we'll see what is the data given in this problem so the mass of monkey m is 15 kg the acceleration that he requires to climb up on the rope is 1 meter per second square and the length of the rope is 5 meter okay so first of all we'll try to observe so this is nothing but a simple motion where uh, the monkey is trying to climb up and there is a force acting downward direction and the acceleration required in the upward direction which is a okay so we'll create a fbd of this monkey and from that say this is a monkey and the mg force downward t is upward and the acceleration is also in upward direction so the equation of motion will become t minus mg is equal to ma okay so if i put the values so this will become t minus 15 kg is the mass of the monkey and g is say 10 is equal to 15 kg is the mass of the monkey and the acceleration required is 1 meter per second square so after solving this we will get t is equal to 165 newton so this is the first part of this problem now for the second part we have to find the time required to climb up the monkey to the ceiling okay so we can use the distance formula as s is equal to ut plus half of at square where s is known to us which is 5 meter u is the initial velocity which is zero because the monkey is starting from the rest t we have to find it out acceleration is given as 1 meter per second square okay so after feeding this value in, into this equation this is going to be 5 is equal to 0 is the initial velocity into t plus half of acceleration is 1 into t square so this will become 10 is equal to t square that means t is equal to under root 10 seconds so this is the solution of this problem